In tonight's Education Watch, we all want a shorter week, and a local school district may just get that. West Jefferson School District is looking at changing the school week to four days instead of five. Local News 8's Febin Kasahun looked into the possibility of that change. The halls of West Jefferson High School may turn empty on Fridays. That's because the school board may change the weekly schedule from a five day to a four day. Right now, the school board is fact finding, so nothing has been set in stone. Superintendent Dwight Richen says the surrounding school districts are in the four day schedule, and the community is who is pushing for the change. In the past four day school weeks, the emphasis was on money being saved. Most of the school districts that are on the four day week, you, it was finances that drove them. And so this is a little different. English teacher Jason Taylor has a bit of a different perspective because he's taught on a four day week before in Marshall Valley. He understands the skepticism but says the transition will be beneficial. I think student and teacher morale improves. You know, there's less burnout at the end of the year. Attendance improves, I think, both teachers and, and students. The district saves a little money. Uh, as a result. Uh, and they do all that while I think not impacting student achievement. 31 year educator Mark Sawicki says he comes from an old school background in terms of how schools operate and scheduling. He opposes the idea. I think the more days you spend with students, the better the teaching, the better the learning that occurs in classrooms. The switch won't necessarily affect school teachers. It will affect bus drivers, school cooks, and those on part time schedules. Food Service Director Lisa Ward thinks the idea of a four day school week sounds fun, but says it's going to be tough for people who are making a living. It's really going to affect my workers in here that are part time. In these small communities, they need their jobs, and it's really, really important that we're able to employ these people that they'll go elsewhere. Superintendent Richens says there are pros and cons to the prospective change. For starters, the pros means most athletics will be moved. To the weekend. The district will save money, student attendance will increase, teacher salaries will remain the same, and less substitutes because most teachers will use Fridays as days for personal appointments. The cons are bus drivers, food service workers, and part time workers will have a 20% pay cut since they're missing a day. Longer school days, which lead to later practices, and at risk students will lose classroom help. The next school board meeting will be next Monday, November 28th at 9 a.m. That will take place in the district office in Tariton. The meeting is open to the public, and parents and other people will be able to voice their opinions. If the school board votes for the four-day school week, the new schedule is set for 2017-2018 school year.